Builder setting up, flashes going into the B bomb site, and Fiku leading the charge, looking for a victim with that clock. He hasn't found one yet. Sui instead, and Chaos coming back into it. This is looking very good for the defense. Bomb is on the ground, and they are getting slaughtered on that T side. Just Dexter in a one versus five. They were on the site, Cody, with flashes and everything, and they got no kills. I mean, it just fell to the wayside, right? Um, how much do you believe in Dexter Supremacy, chat? That is the real question. Do you think that he's going to be able to clutch this out and do us a 1v5? That is the real one here. Glock in hand, no utility, no armor. Men all around him that just want to tap him out of this round. And yeah, it's slides wiped there by CK. It's, it's over and done with. You know, to get, otherwise you can never get back in. The benefit is, Gamer Legion have an English coach. Ash is from the oh, UK. Okay. So, uh, well, I'm, look, there's method to the madness. All it's right. definitely madness, but there's method there. All right, some consistency. I appreciate that. Again, this time with Tech Nines and Mac 10s, it might be worth it. The Molotov is actually a little bit failed there, and they run right into the M4. Nico, though, good return. I am going to be taking down Dexter, and it's a three on three with a bomb, soon to be planted. Tackle on the lurk once again, trying to get a kill from the sidelines, does indeed find it. The M4 being recovered from Neofrag, he needs to come out on top here, but Kiku looking through a lot of the damage. Neofrag picks up one, picks up two. Now in a one versus one, with Acor being down to 22 HP as well, it's very possible he's going to be able to win this one. It's actually heavily favored. No kit available either, so it's going to be a 10 second stick if he's going to do it. Pros don't fake, taps it, holds it. Neofrag needs to go for the swing, but he rushed him with the Tech 9 instead. Yeah, well, that doesn't matter. There's USPs. Deep flash here. Oh, they will get the first one. This is not bad. Acor will pick up a kill. They are all going to get slaughtered in that corner, unfortunately, but they've done some significant damage. You know what? Fair play to Gamer Legion. Three kills. It's not bad. This is quite funny because you, you were talking about the conditioning and it's like um, full by round. First one that we're going to be seeing in this game and it's going to be Nico. It opens things up. Taking out nine. Yeah, what a fight to win in the middle after the fact. Acor, though, taking down Flames. Almost looked like he wanted to push through. Sui back here is going to be getting a kill on Neofry, but Fiku is back. Double headshot with the AK and Nico and Acor. You can smell him. Both Danes on opposite side of the smoke here. Yes. Oh. <laughs> he misses the chance. I don't know if that was a quick or a no scope, but either way, Nico is quick to spin around and it leaves Isaac one versus three here to try and do something I don't even know. He, you've already lost a couple of rounds here. Maybe it's worth it to give it a shot, but Dexter's going to be ready the back of the bomb site. Lurking oh. a player into mid, and, well, they're sending it over towards B. They're doing don't, it again. Look, simply don't change what's not broken. Just keep going for it. Kezos is going to be able to find a nice opener there to be able to take down Nico. Oh, Akor picks up one of the process as well, using the smoke above the molly to his advantage. But Kezos on this pillar doing so much work, and Dexter's like, oh, I haven't been in this situation before. Uh, it's, it's a 1vx and you're hoping to catch at least one CT player that's flashed, but they're not really to be found anywhere. Oh, the scope kind of betrays him there. There's nobody to be found. The match has started. We see some shooting. Oh, it's only going a few centimeters from the players. Oh, this grenade may end this match. It's the explosion in. It's a hit! What's happening? Did he run out of ammunition? What will he do now? It's a magazine! Incredible! And we have the winner! Our winner gets a box with incredible skins from Keydrop. We also have something special for all the viewers. With the above promo code, you get 50 cents to start with and 10% bonus from deposit. Oh, wow. Goes for the swing. Oh, it's absolutely no damage, just reveals himself. Does now swing on back though towards B and manages to find one kill, dinks up Neo in the process. What? Quite a sloppy round if I'm being completely honest. Chaos quite close, sprays down one on the hunt for the remainder of the OG squad. Flash now available. Pop goes out. Here's the audio, but I don't think it pops in time when he swings. It pops after he dies. So now it's going to be Acor rotating over. He's completely whited. Misses the first shot as Flames jumps it. Skips over the top. Bomb is now going to get planted by Fiku. Oh. Dexter finding I'm on the back lines as well. This three versus two is looking almost unwinnable here from Gamer Legion. Oh man, that flash attempt from Chaos was so close. Less of a tenth of a second for him to get that kill. Isaac peeks into it, but Flames with the headshot and Fiku on the follow-up, and it's a nice oh, Sui yeah. again is pushing forward. He's done this almost every single round, but oh, he actually will get the kill anyway. That looked like Dexter wasn't going to go for it. That's a little bit surprising. Yeah, it seemed like Dexter just caught a little bit napping there. He was holding on the angle, but of course, with the molly down, like the smoke that was there, just certainly not uh, not helping the situation. Yeah, it was one bullet. Chaos does so much damage with the HEs anyway, so dropping Neo Frag in just a single round of the M4. Acor on the back line is going to be able to find Nico. But this wrap here from Flames is really nice in Red Room. 
It's now going to be on the hunt for a little bit more. Of course, he has an inkling there's someone over towards Donut, but doesn't have the positional advantage to be able to take him down. Fiku, bomb on his back. He's like, you know what? I'm running over towards mid, see what ground I can find. That's something that's kind of been neglected from OG, and yes. uh, they just haven't gone for this mid presence at all. It's just, just one of those days, Ooh, isn't it? boost, hello. Yeah, that was sick. Oh, oh, he got the dick, but he can't find the kill. Isaac in the middle eventually is going to get flashed and ultimately taken down. It is a three on three, but only, only if you look at the numbers. Look at the health that's left here. Come on, this off angle waiting for the swing, but... With all of them getting posted up inside of Temple, if they swing on through, yeah, Nico does just miss the shot. Sprays down one, looks for the second here. There's a, oh, it's pretty close. Pretty close. He needed to hit that second kill and then the amount of damage they do, the rate of fire, just the spread. It's just, it is three kills. Well, nice. only if you can see your opponent. And Flames simply could not. He's always the person who's doing these high progressive pushes into Red Room up towards, uh, uh, up towards CT Spawn. Nico does not care about your Molotov. He will run through it. Uh, up close now is a core. Ooh, it, it's not the most effective range for the orb, but it gets the job done. Chaos is going to be able to find a kill there as well. Secondary shot going to be with Death Maker. It's the Eagles just looking for anything they can find. Dex is going to be able to find one on the fadeaway, but the Suhei closes it out. It's the seventh round now. Give That's... me a chicken squeeze. Hold up. You went for the effort of, you know, brought it through customs at the airport and all the rest of it. Like, <laughs> just do it. Oh, that was nice. Yeah. So again, he's been playing that same position over and over and over again. And they ran into him a couple of times. This time, they preemptively Molotov him and just shut him down. Five versus three right off the bat. And to be, tr to be honest, it's going to be very hard for Gamer Legion to get back in the round. I oh. am, though. Oh, that's sick. A double kill. And they're back into a two-on-two. Two. He's almost got the triple Can't in the back line, this. jumping on top of the box with a USB. He's lost his Are mind. He's just fighting them with a pistol instead of reloading his gun. I don't even know why. Dexter is in trouble and about to bit maybe flanked here. Kios, you surely never read this if you're Dexter. How could you possibly know? There's the little tap coming in, and they bring it back in a three-on-five. I really think they were super confused, and he was playing on top of the smoke. Oh, here we go. Yes. Run boost. He still got the headshot. How is that even possible? He was mid-air. Acor now put into a corner, but this is where he's very, very dangerous. We'll finally miss the shot there. Only the one kill, and Neofrag quick to take him down. Well handled. Uh, Suhei on the back lines. Oh, he's trigger disciplining this. He's waiting to see what sort of information he can find. Need to be careful about him turning around, though. There we go. It's not clean. It's the second round of the row. We've seen that Dex has been killed from behind but it's not been a clean crisp kill that molly going down now i think oh kind God. of secures the round oh thank you excuse me pop flash goes in and neofrag's looking to shotgun it as well not gonna be able to find anything two seconds remaining needs to get him hits the no scope hits the second as well to be able to close it out it's an eight seven half gamer legion still in the lead you can just you can just keep it keep going really hard at it which is good fun and a little bit overpowered here we go Flames flashed in. It's a really nice idea, but he misses the headshot that he was looking for, and now Fiku is pretty much dead behind it. It's a great pistol round for Kios. So far, he's got the triple, and they're up against Nico in a one versus three, and they have no real incentive to go and fight him. He has to try and find three kills and defuse the bomb. Why would you make it easier by making it two kills? Chaos does want that 4K, though. Yeah. <laughs> he's, well, look, that's, that's the incentive. It's... Hey, I get a 4K and a pistol round. It's always nice to have, right? Pad those HLTV stats. Uh, Nico, just trying to tap away, seeing what he can find, but it's going to be absolutely nothing. With no kit, there's not a chance in hell he wins this round. Does take down I'm. He's going to be able to find Acor as well on the swing. I think everyone is dead to the bomb here. So uh, there's a world in which Nico just runs away to be able to potentially save. But no, they've actually timed it. Pelagian are setting up outside and they don't have any more needs. They have a couple of flashes to try and do this. This is actually super scary. What a headshot. Oh, dear. Fiku taking down Isaac. Now I'm a little bit worried for Gamer Legion. They're about to push into a very stacked bomb site. 19 seconds. One mistake here and they might be done. Nico taking a sweet time. But he did get the headshot on Chaos. And this is looking tough. Oh, for the smoke. Oh, they get one more headshot in the space of three seconds four people go down on the og side of the day and it's still an 11th round for gamelish three on the trot now and they're looking for this additional mid presence it's completely blind flames has no idea what happened and suhei just spams it down that's the bomb being dropped inside oh, the mid no. now as well and it's neofrag the man the myth himself holding with this m4 and oh now holding a flash in his hand and getting taken down oh no he really wasn't sure if a third player had made their way into donut so a little bit confusing 
Still a three on three, Nico. It's such a lineup. Oh. He's going to get both of them, even if Isak was watching and play, well played by him to actually keep his eye on that. But it was just too much, yeah, which could work in his favor. There is actually plenty of time for him to be able to make a play. It's almost certainly not going to convert into a round, but at least it could be a bomb plant. The low HP player and the former Nico going to get taken down by Acor. He's in a position to be able to grab the bomb, grabs it, but. Grabs a bullet there. Oh. Does he see it now? He certainly oh. does. That was labored. Good opening, although he does take a fair bit of damage. That's wow. the missing a shot that should have been very straightforward. And OG now with a very tough choice. They don't have a lot of money unless they get a kill through the smoke here. Saving these three rifles is probably statistically the better, the, the better play, even if it really sucks. You don't really get to play for the round at all. Yeah, it's, it definitely feels bad. It's quite interesting that they play flames on that long angle instead of Dexter, and Dexter playing up close and personal with the... Uh, with the AWP. Like, swapping positions there surely opens up some more opportunities for Dexter. Maybe it came down to the utility and wanted to have more utility over towards mid just in case. But I don't know, it, it feels like those roles certainly should have been switched. And Dexter then had the opportunity. Um, of course, Flames goes down, but he had the opportunity to be able to potentially save if all things do go south on the A bomb site for those first. So many times. He'd There's need to get at least a double here. I don't, oh, Acor sticking around. Now they're starting to run away a little bit. He's thinking about it, Nico. He goes for it. He's sneaking up close, and Acor is thinking about it too. There's the tap on the bomb. They're going to stop him. It's fine. Well played from Acor. Otherwise, want to risk it, and that's what they're doing right here. Yeah, Nico pushing forward. Acor still waiting down there. He does move just as the beat comes through, and Nico is crazy. He's going to keep pushing, even though he already got found out, nearly catching the AWP on that corner. That would have been sick. Yeah, but they know. Oh, they will bang end. him down. That is so sick. Dexter trying to hold on to it. They know that. Oh, they can guess he's probably alone. What a tap from Isaac as well. Neo Frag and Dexter, two versus three, 30 seconds, and they are backtracking. They're going to be facing Neo Frag in this A bomb site. It's a big man to be facing up against. He's got the A4 in hand as well. The extra bullets in the mag. Who's going to try and test him first? Util comes through. Acor's the first man. Takes down one. Continues the spray, but he's only good for one this time round. Uncharacteristic from him. Him, but it seemed like Gamer Legion realized what situation they were in. Dexo was going to be the first person there. If they see it's an M4 instead, okay, we know it's Neo. We know he's just going to continue holding the spray control. So we send the first person in and then we delay the rest of the push. Spending his hard earned cash on. He wants to have that buffer to be able to rebuy that AWP if possible. This is what you were talking about earlier on as well, by the way. The fact that Acor, like, he will play this aggro angle, and it's like, if he can do it again and again, he will keep re swinging you. And if you give him an, an inch, he will take a mile. Yeah. You swung him once. It doesn't really have to come and fight this at the moment. Nico doesn't either. No, but this is an interesting one two setup. Nico's going to be the first point of contact. Oh, a shutdown, and they're ready for it. Great read there for the Game Legion side. They knew that that was a possibility, and it would have been different for sure if Nico would have got the opening kill. Everything changes behind that. 100%. And now this boost, long there waiting. There it is. A call rewarded for his patience as Neo Frank gets shut down. And for OG, this is a force up and a disaster as well. If they lose this round, they might very well lose this map. Dexter is thinking he's never going to financially recover from this. His investment is squandered as everyone falls to the wayside apart from him. The King of Donut is just sitting here. What a flash. Yeah, I mean, he probably is just trying to aggressively defend the AWP, hoping that not everyone exits this way, but just, you know, maybe one or two like it is. They're gonna be one, but now they this know where rough. he is and they're definitely gonna come for him. There's, if they lose everything here, it's fine. Just get that AWP away from him. Picked up an AK to try and defend himself even wow. further. It's a good couple of kills, but it is absolutely worth it. 3Ks of nowhere. If he's more involved, maybe post someone else over there. Get Neofrag inside of there, holding that angle instead. Get Dexter on these long sidelines who can be more impactful earlier into the round instead of having to be that solo player towards the end. The TT side, that is it. And Game of Legion, I think, smartly God, waiting. They can see this coming. They know that they need to do something aggressive, and they're getting slaughtered on that B ramp. No shot here. Fiku, he's going to get one in return, but deep breath for the Game of Legion side. They don't need to fight this right now. How has Dexter found the money, the pocket lint, to be able to pay the arms dealer to grab this orb? I mean, he's once again inside of Donut. Oh my God, how does he miss that shot? He shoots between the legs or something. How does he whip it? That's insanely bad. I think it's done. I yeah. actually think the game is lost from that. That's really heartbreaking because they might, I mean, you want to see them and get that shot. They've given up the A-bomb side now. Somehow, they still get the shot on Isak. It's a two versus three now. And the bomb 
It's kind of close there. They're holding the CT spawn as well. Very nice position from IM at the moment. Fiku's going to be walking Ooh. right into the spray. Connects. Huge double kill. And now it's a one on one. He's walking in for it. IM. He needs wow. the hit shot. And he will get it as well. Instant shutdown. And Gamer Legion with a little bit of a shocking upset here. Taking down OG.